I right. thank the gentleman. Chair, and I recognize the gentleman from the great state of Alabama. Thank you, Chairman Strong Rogers. Five I, I thank our witnesses. Um, thank you for being here today. Air Force Secretary selects Huntsville, Alabama as preferred location to host U.S. Space Command. This press release was published by the Air Force two years, three months, and 14 days ago. After a strategic basing process that dates back to December 2018, the Air Force selected Redstone Arsenal in Huntsville, Alabama as the preferred location for the United States Space Command headquarters. The Air Force made this selection following assessments of site visits, factors related to mission, infrastructure, capacity, community support, and the cost to the Department of Defense. It's also going uh, up on the screen. I want to highlight a specific line. And I quote, we got this. And I quote, Huntsville compared favorably across more of these factors than any other community, providing a large qualified workforce, quality schools, superior infrastructure capacity, and low initial and reoccurring cost, end quote. Secretary Kendall, out of six candidate locations, do you know which location had the highest final score for the, for the uh, set factors and criteria? You talk about the previous analysis, Congressman? Yes. Uh, I believe I do. Uh, it was uh, Redstone Arsenal in Huntsville, Alabama, with nine criteria in the top third ranking. Based on those same criteria, do you know how Peterson Space Force uh, base fared? I do not recall how Peterson fared. Well, let me help you. Uh, Peterson had five criteria in the top third, six in the middle, and 10 in the bottom criteria. Immediately following the Air Force's announcement on January the 13th of 2021, our friends out west sent a letter to the president-elect asking him, and I quote, reverse the decision. And then again on January the 26th, requesting President Biden to conduct, I quote, a thorough review, close quote, of the decision, and again, quote, suspend any action to, re, to uh, relocated headquarters, close quote, until the review was completed. They did not say what is best for national security. They said reverse the decision. On February the 19th, 2021, the Department of Defense Inspector General's Office opened an investigation on the Space Command basing decision. The Government Accountability Office followed suit exactly one month later. The GAO report included the following statement regarding the evaluation phase, and I quote, there was a sizable break, a sizable break between the top two scoring locations and the third place location. Mr. Secretary, I know you're familiar with these rankings. Uh, they're going up on the screen again. Uh, just for the record, which sites uh, were the Air Force's top two locations during this evaluation phase? I think you have it on the screen. Congress. Thank you. It's correct. Redstone Arsenal, Huntsville, Alabama. Uh, thank you, Mr. Secretary. Again, just for the record, what was Colorado's uh, rank during the evaluation uh, phase? I think you have that on the screen also. That's right. They were fourth. Thank you, Mr. Secretary. I know you're uh, also familiar with the selection phase. I want to put these rankings uh, on the screen as well. For the record, which site was the Air Force's top preference during the selection phase? Uh, that's on the screen, Congressman. Thank you. Redstone Arsenal, Huntsville, Alabama. The DOD Inspector General report, which was published on May 10th, 2021, stated that the Air Force's basing uh, process for Space Command Headquarters, and I quote, complied with law and policy and was reasonable in identifying Huntsville, Alabama as the preferred location. And just to make it clear, uh, that same report also was quoted saying, therefore, the ranking of Colorado as the preferred permanent location was not supportable. Redstone Arsenal was the top site for the U.S. Space Command Headquarters throughout the entire process. That is a fact. The report attempting to overturn the decision requested by the Colorado delegation proved that the Air Force's process was unbiased and reasonable. That is another fact. Mr. Secretary, in May of 2022, you testified that you were hoping to move forward with a final decision as quickly as you could. 
Last month, you testified you're expecting a decision fairly soon. Why on earth have we not received a final decision regarding U.S. Space Command headquarters? The gentleman's time's expired. As much as I would love to allow him to go on, uh, <laughs> I must move on to the gentleman uh, from Texas, Mr.